justice system, not accepting the uh, abuse and other things that are going on uh, in the courts regarding elders. Um, and we've done uh, several uh, workshops. I've talked several workshops in regard to workshops in powers of attorney, healthcare powers of attorney, and, and, and advising um, others uh, in those areas because it's so important. Um, that's one area of law that everybody's going to be touched by eventually, one way or the other. Uh, and so I'm going to leave you with this. Uh, as Judge Boyd so eloquently said, there are three reasons, I would say, that, that people need to change their thinking about judicial races. It's you, your family, and your friends and neighbors. Why do I say that? Because out of those three entities, one of them knows someone or is affected by foreclosure. One of them is affected by maybe family law. One of them might be affected by the criminal justice system. And as Judge Boyd said, we are going to step before a judge and have an interaction with the judge in any, even a speeding ticket before we can you know, be able to talk to the president, senator, and you know, the committee may try to call your alderman and see if they'll give you a call right back and you can just walk in there and speak to them. But you have the access to the judges and we have the ability and the power to elect judges that would seem to provide um, at least a semblance of what we understand commonalities to be with an understanding of what we're, where we're coming from and understanding of the effect that it has upon us generally. So um, that being said, I'm going to, uh, you know, my, my bishop taught me, uh, you get up to preach, get to the cross as soon as possible, and then sit down. So uh, since I'm not, he said, if you talk about anything else, sit down as soon as possible. So I'm doing that right now. I thank you so much for your time, and uh, may the Lord continue to bless you. My punch number is 154. And that's, that's a great sign to me because since the, the mantra for our campaign is restoring people's faith in the law, I can say you know, we, we're going to restore if you punch 154. <laughs> so I need to tell everybody about Judge Boyd and Soul Slate uh, is, is, a, is a group of qualified African American candidates. Most people don't know who the judges are at all. And so I have some, uh, I have some uh, Soul Slate forms also that both uh, uh, Judge Boyd and myself are on. And it just gives you more information as a resource to be able to understand and be able to select uh, qualified African American candidates for the various offices in the county. And say, God bless you all. Thank you so much. We've got to have these two. I don't know about you two. You are, but I know who I'm going for. These two guys, they got me. I don't know about y'all. I don't know if y'all felt the energy, but they, all, they, they know what they're talking about. They said, here, it's your time, your busy schedule to come here for you all. Now we want to have a moment to have some Q&As out here, but first I would like Clara Hubbard to kind of set the stage from this.